This drain cannot be cleared, said two other plumbers. I wonder if this drain's even connected. We'll send the camera down and have a little bit of a sticky beacon. Oh, mate. Oh, no. Wow. We're back for another blocked drain. And guys, today, I'm bloody excited about this one. This is going to be a ripper. Let's open the door here. Hello, anyone home? It's Bruce the plumber. No one's home. They did say walk through, but today we got a kitchen sink that is apparently chocker block and two other plumbers they couldn't sort it out. So the pressure is on and I bloody love it when I'm under pressure. And here's the kitchen sink. Let's just, let's get straight into it and see what's bloody going on, eh? <laughs> Hang on a second, mate. That doesn't look blocked. Someone's either pulling me chain or I've got the Midas touch. And I know I've got the Midas touch, even though, you know, I don't like to blow me own trumpet. But what we'll do is we'll have a stroll on through. Apparently there is a second kitchen in here and this looks like something's going on. Oh, what do you know? There it is. I thought it was here somewhere. We bloody found it, mate. So we'll turn the tap on, we'll fill her up and we'll test her out and see what's... Hang on a second. Not even bloody connected to the drain. This drain cannot be cleared, said two other plumbers. And if you've been watching the channel for a while, you'll know that's bloody music to my ears, mate. Anyway, we'll shine the torch down this drain and have a look. Oh, wow. There is something down there. Wow, well, you know what we got to do, guys. Let's get the drain camera out. So the first plumber who attended told the owner, sorry mate, the drain's not even connected, can't do anything about it. We'll send the camera down and have a little bit of a sticky beacon. Oh mate, oh no. Well, whatever it is, it's not ideal, is it? Looks like a bloody giant marshmallow or something, mate. But anyway, it's going to be difficult to jet because all the excess water from the jet is just going to flood this place out. But... I've got an idea, guys. Now, what I'm thinking is, I'm just wanting to know, look, is that a blockage with building rubble or sand or cement, or does the waste pipe just not go anywhere, you know? Are we just gonna be drilling into a concrete slab? So I'm gonna send me a little drill bit down here and we'll see if we can get it on camera. And here we are, let's try and bloody smash through it and see what we're up against. Oh, wow. It's, it's brittle. It's brittle. That's good news. Well, it could be good news. It just could be a giant bloody sand bundy, mate. And this waste pipe is just stuck into the sand or into the dirt. And if that's the case and there's no drain, mate, we are, we're in a little bit of strife. So anyway, as I was saying, guys, there's been two plumbers here. The first plumber couldn't clear it. And the second plumber, mate, the second plumber's turned up and he's told the owner there's a heap of building rubble down your drain, there's nothing I can do about it. So the owners contacted me and I said, mate, you're in safe hands. Don't get your knickers in a knot. You know, we'll head over, we'll get it sorted. It won't be a problem. So now the bloody pressure's on, isn't it? So let's bloody hope that I don't have egg on my face, mate. And look at that. It's bloody sand, isn't it? That's worrying. Let's stick the camera down and have another good look. Oh no, we literally just Digging down into sand. I don't reckon the pipe bloody goes anywhere, mate. We'll take the camera out and we'll go for a wander around the property and see if we can find an inspection opening to the drain because this is chockers, mate. Now, with any luck, we'll come across a gully just outside here somewhere. We'll have a look. Well, the sink's inside there and there is no inspection point for this drain. There's no gully. I can find an inspection point over here. This will be for the dunny just behind this wall. It's not going to help us. What are we going to do? Let's get the jet up, send it downstream, and unblock this drain. Let's get stuck in, guys. Hang on a second. Are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? It was staring us in the bloody face. Let's have a go. <laughs> Have a little sticky beacon. Oh, oh, I guess it's progress. I mean, is this genius, you know? Is this rocket science material? Am I in the wrong career? I don't know. Let's fire the vacuum up. Let's have another go.
Oh, 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 well, we are getting somewhere, you little ripper. Well, this is one way to do it. We'll get the drill down and no more Mr. Nice Guy. Let's get stuck right in. I've just been real careful that I'm not going to hit an elbow or a pipe and drill through it, mate. Let's fire up the vacuum cleaner. Boys, I'm actually a little bit worried that one of those plumbers is right and this drain isn't even connected. Send the camera down and have another sticky beacon. Oh, I'm sweating bullets right now, mate. And Oh, wow, was that the... I just don't know what to say. I know I sound like a bloody broken record, but is that the end of the pipe and we're just drilling into sand? You know, I have told the owner that, you know, not to knot those knickers and we'll get it sorted and bloody, you know... Maybe he needs to start thinking about knotting them. I hear at the back, Bruce, Bruce, how are you going to get yourself out of this situation, you smart ass? And mate, it's a fair call, but I've got some little tricks up my sleeve right here. I'm going to try and bloody build a little overflow pipe. And what I'll do is we'll send the jet through the drain here, we'll have a bucket set up so the overflow can run through this 90 degree elbow and into a bucket. And let's pretend it's bloody rocket science, mate, because this is some big brain stuff, you know? I'll give you a quick little bloody demonstration. And I've got me whip hose here that I prepared earlier. And we'll send the whip hose down the little inspection cap of that 90 degree elbow. Send it downstream like that. And there's your bucket, mate. Bob is your mother's brother, your brother's mother. I don't know. But the overflow goes straight into the bucket, mate. Easy. Some of you older subscribers would remember when it worked in the past. Remember this video? Oh, look at that. It's thick. It is thick. Wow! <laughs> and we're away, guys, you little ripper! Woohoo! I've just turned the jet off now. What on earth is going on? Surely, surely we haven't cleared this drain. Something doesn't make sense. I bloody hope the water is not pumping underneath this slab. Let's have a look down here. Wow, what's going on, guys? Is it clear? No way. All right, I'm still a little nervous. I want to send the camera down and see if we've actually cleared this drain or water is just pumping underneath the slab of this house. Come on, mate. Get in there. There we are. Oh, wow. There's an elbow. That's the base of the elbow. Try and send the camera around the bend here. Oh, mate. We've done it. We have done it. And I, I told the owner it wouldn't be a problem. And, you know, you heard me the whole time. I was cool. I was calm. I was collected, mate. I knew I could do it. We knew we could do it. Let's hook the bloody sink up. And just like magic, let's fill the sink up and test her out, mate. Well, it's the moment of truth now, guys. Let's pull the plug. Hey, 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 you little rip. 
Tampa! Woohoo! Any leaks under here? Of course there's no leaks, guys. It's a bloody job well done, mate.